Kerbal Space Program, a game built for mm-hmm. aspiring engineers and future astronauts, maybe. Maybe one of you guys will become an astronaut. But most people in this game build space exploration vehicles, rockets, whatever, you name it. But I'm different. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you my space battleship. Yep, this is probably the most insane thing I have ever built. Well, hello guys, so welcome to another Kerbal Space Program video. And like the intro said, we're going to be building a space battleship. And essentially, I got this idea after watching a video from the channel Found and Explained. And basically, the channel went on about Project Orion, which involved the space battleship that inspired me to build whatever this thing is in this video. And Project Orion originally wasn't a weapons program. It was actually a nuclear propulsion program set by NASA, DARPA, and the United States Air Force. They wanted to see if it was viable for a spacecraft to use nuclear propulsion. But you know how things go. It became weaponized. And eventually, they made a concept of this super large spacecraft that could carry 500 nuclear warheads into space, which would basically turn the Orion into the world's largest nuclear capable launch platform, but in space. And also for this video, I wanted to try a different type of recording format. So I wanted to try doing voiceovers. So similar to how like Matt Lone and Scott Manley used to make their KSP videos. They, they mainly do voiceovers. But I also want to add live commentary as my other videos. So if you have any ideas on like how to improve the videos or like any suggestions that you might have, just leave it down in the comments below and I will see if I can do that. So let's get back to the live commentary. Let's make this thing just super simple. So we're going to rebuild from scratch. You know what? Okay. Well, okay, let's calm down our, on our weapons. And let's make a giant, like, spaceship. Up, oh, just like that. Okay, and then we will put an adapter. Oh, man, it's so nice building without lag. And then, boom. And now we can put the missiles. Yep. Mark 1. Boom. Radial. Boom. Boom. Just like that. Okay, so this is our nukes. Imagine these are nukes. Okay, we are getting double the frames as the other one. Instead of, oh, never mind. Massive spike right there. Instead of getting only 5 FPS, we're getting 10. So, we're just going to do a quick test with the weapon. So engines on. Increase power. Okay, they're working. They're working. Increase power just a little bit. And then SAS on. Because these all have guidance units. So they should be able to control themselves. And if I'm correct, these should all just fire straight. Oh no. I mean it works. Look at that. Okay, that's, oh, oh, oh my goodness gracious, oh, oh no. Oh, <laughs> okay, that's pretty sick, that's pretty sick. So, we're going to do that again, but this time, more power. Okay, maybe 24, I think 24 is a good number. So, one more. Boom. This looks actually insane. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness, what have I made? This is actually insane looking. And of course, we're gonna need spaces for the people working this Orion battleship. So we need to make some compartments for people. And around this time, I kind of figured out that I couldn't add cargo modules to the wing connectors directly. So the square things that you see on the side, as well as the passenger modules. And this kind of made me pretty frustrated because 
If I really can't attach those by itself, then I would have to basically make a very rough fuselage. I basically had to make an entire plane fuselage just so I can put cargo and passenger modules on my Orion. So I basically made a plane with no wing, just threw it on the side of my Orion, and I just had to deal with it. Gotta do what I gotta do. And I mean, it works, so there's nothing wrong with that. Few moments later. Okay. Okay, this is, this is, I think this is actually working. So yeah, I don't think I'm going to be doing another mega project like this because the loading screen alone, just from me going from the building bay to the launch pad took probably two minutes, okay? That's insane. So this might be one of the last mega projects that I'm going to do until I get a new CPU because right now my computer cannot handle this. Oh my goodness, I'm getting like 3 FPS. Oh, I just saw 1 FPS. This is not good at all. This is not good. But we will still go for it. Let's go, Jebediah. We are going to space. This is a single stage to orbit space battleship. Okay, we just gotta reach space. I know you can reach space. Come on, just keep going. No, the solar ar arrays. They fell off. Dang it, I should have kept them retracted. Come on, keep going. Okay. Things are swaying. Things are actually swaying. This is not good. Oh no, 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 we're getting stability. We're getting instability. That's not good. Let's lower power. Let's lower the power. We gotta keep ourselves orientated. Come on. You have been doing so well. Yes, you're almost there. You're almost there. Okay. 30 more kilometers. Just 30 more. We are approaching. We are. We just. We just broke Mach 3. So. We are currently at. We're. Well, we're about to reach 50 kilometers. So. Speed is still at around 1500 meters per second. So we are doing very well. Oh no. That's. More oscillations. Okay. Okay, we are officially at 62,000 meters. We're probably going to go over 70,000 meters. So we are we are in space, okay? We are actually in space now. Which is what we really wanted. So, we're just going to switch the map real fast, see how far we are going. Man, this is terrible. 5 FPS. Are you kidding me? So, our apoapsis is at 200,000 meters so roughly that's about like 180 something miles so what I'm gonna do okay is cut power boom gonna go up here oh my goodness this light is insane we're gonna warp here and look at that 271,000 meters Oh my goodness, look at this. This is 1,800 tons in space. You are looking at 1,800 tons in space. Yeah, I don't think my PC is liking this. Not one second. But look at this. This looks insane. It's a space battleship. Okay. Okay. Before my game actually explodes, let's do a weapons test. If we can launch one stinking missile, this is successful. We have built a very rough Orion. Because I don't think I can build an accurate, realistic, one-to-one -one Orion. Because my computer will actually blow up like the nukes that I'm about to send. So, nukes on. Okay, they are on. Okay, SAS is on. Three, two, one, fire. Oh 
<gasps> Look at them go! Oh my goodness. Wait, wait, can I switch to them? Yes, I can! Look at that! Wait, wait. I'm a nuke. We have no probe control, but look! Wow. Wow. This is probably the coolest thing I've ever built. Look, it's so big! We have gone so far, and it's barely... Wow, okay. Let's switch back to the main ship. Okay, and now let's do the main cluster. I'm very, very worried about this. So, engine's on. It's a lot of engines, okay. We're gonna ramp it up. Let's do 30%. And fire. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Whoa, look at that! <gasps> this is so cool. Oh my... G this is actually really cool. Wow, okay, okay. Let's, let's go back to the main ship. Oh, look at that! Look at it! Look at, look at the other nukes go! Well... Missiles, technically. Well, spaceships. I don't even know. This is just sick. This is just cool. Release the rest of them. So, engines on. Max power this time. We're gonna test max power. So, releasing in 3, 2, 1. Okay. Whoa, look how fast it's going. Oh, look, 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 look. Okay, this one's about to pass. Where is it? Oh, look at it. Oh, yeah, that, that, okay, okay, that one, okay. That one is definitely going to hit something down there. Okay, let's release some of the... Let's release the next batch slower this time. So, engine's on. Okay, throttle it down just a little bit. Just right. Just like that. Right here. Okay, so these ones have gone. Those have gone as well. Oh my goodness gracious! Look at this! This might be the destroyer of worlds right here. I wonder what this looks like on the on the map. Oh my goodness gracious, look at this. Oh. Okay, whoever lives in these two areas right here, this one and this one, gone, bro. Just absolutely gone. The battleship has absolutely destroyed everything. This is hands down one of the most insane things I have ever built. Like, one of the most insane things I have ever built. An actual space battleship. Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me?